What's going on, everybody? It's Bruce from EcomCong. I really hope that you enjoyed that Zendrop Shopify store build series and already began putting some of those strategies into play. That's going to be the first of many series like that on the channel, so be sure to stay tuned. Hit that like button and subscribe. Now, this video is going to be a little bit different. It's going to be shorter. We're just going to be going over how to add a gift to your product pages. And if you watch the store build series, you know that we like to add at least two to three gifts per product page. It really helps capture that customer's attention and gets them to stay on your product pages and on your store, which means that they're going to be more likely to purchase. Now, stay tuned to the end of this video where we share with you a link to create a high converting product page. Let's get started. If you watch the full Zendrop Shopify store build series, you probably heard me talk about adding a GIF to your product page. Now, what you see on the screen right here is an example of a GIF. It's an image. It's an animated image that continuously shows a video over and over again. And we like to add two or three of these per product page to show different aspects of our product in action. Another reason why we like to add GIFs to our product page is it captures the customer's attention and keeps them on our product pages and our stores longer. And the longer that a customer is interacting with us and on our site, the more likely they are to purchase. So we're going to go on over to Giphy.com and we're going to go ahead and click create. And we're going to upload our video. And here are some options you have. You can choose how uh, the duration of the GIF, so how long uh, the clip that you want to play over and over again is. And then you can also choose the start time. So we'll go ahead and we'll use these buttons to create di different variations of the GIFs uh, for our product pages. All you gotta do is click continue to decorate. You can leave all these blank and upload to GIF. And this usually takes a second or two. All right, so our GIF has been processed and uploaded to Giphy. So now we're gonna go ahead and come over to media. I'm gonna come to this social link and we're gonna copy and come back over here. We're just gonna delete this and go to insert image URL and paste it in right here. So that's our first GIF, click save. And now we're gonna go ahead and create the second variation. I'm gonna go ahead and repeat the same process, but this time we're gonna use the editing tools to show the different aspects of our product. And again, we like to add two or three of these per product page to, sh to show the, those uh, different features. All right, so now we're gonna move the start time over right here, a new clip. And all right, we're gonna cut it off a little shorter and continue to decorate. Let's continue to upload, upload to Giphy. And we're going to go ahead and let it process again. All right, so now it's processed. We're going to come over to media. We're going to go ahead and copy this link again. Come back over to our store. And we got to come back up. Insert image, URL, and paste it in right there. And click save. So now when we go ahead and view the store, now this isn't the same product, but we're using it as an example. We got both GIFs right here running and showing different aspects of the product. And to show you how we typically would set this product page up, we'll come over here and we'll add a headline. So take your workout to the next level. So we'll have a headline there and then we'll immediately show the first GIF. And then over right underneath it, right underneath the first GIF, we'll write a couple sentences, whatever. Um, and then we'll have the next image, the next GIF. And then usually right under the second GIF, we'll have our features and benefits section. And then after here, we'll jump into the bullet points that go over the different features of the product. And if you would like some more training on how to set up uh, the bullet points and your product pages, there'll be a link in the description 
uh, to an article that's on our website that goes over how to create a high converting product page. I hope that this video was able to provide you with some guidance on how to create and add those gifts to your product pages. Now, if you haven't already signed up for your free 90 day Shopify trial or your free plan with Zendrop, the links are in the description below. So be sure to check those out. And if you have any other questions or topics that you want to have covered by me, comment them down below. I'll be checking the comments and we'll be pushing out videos. We'll try to do two or three per week uh, here on out and we'll get those answered for you. Now, until next time, be great.